Ladies in three, two, one, let's get it. You might expect a little extra warm-up might be necessary at a winter event called the Irving Frost 5K. While some are trying to find heat, others find the beat. That's just me. I dance like this every morning. They call themselves the Grandma Crew. And today's her birthday. This is why we're running. So you want to know how old I am? 61 today. Well, how does running help you? It keeps me feeling young. Yeah. And looking young. Yes, and sexy. They are among hundreds of runners about to hit the starting line. Hey, how you feeling? <laughs> They're off, taking on a course starting here at the Toyota Music Factory, going past the new Weston Irving Convention Center Hotel and up Las Colinas Boulevard. Some runners are clearly going for their best time, others for family time. We also saw Mark Sue. We have seen him running here before. Uh, I just really like pandas. And he has kept going. Uh, I started running with the panda head and I got the most support a runner could ever ask for. So starting from then, I just kept wearing it throughout all the seasons. And I have a lot of like sparkle skirts like this and I post it on my social media and that my friends will see it and that's how they can find me at races. Grace Parker is running with the flag in tribute. My dad is a Korean and Vietnam veteran. He passed away early this year. This is my way back to everybody that has been injured. The run is only a little more than three miles, so it's not long before many make their way back and reach the finish to pick up their medals, which double as Christmas tree ornaments. Are you gonna hang that on your tree? Yeah. I don't get to run that much, so whenever I get a chance, I just run. It was a challenge, but at least I finished. With the run complete, these athletes are looking to refuel. We are in Pancakes Bus post-race refreshments. <laughs> Two Miller Lights. This line is for the good stuff. This is what we run for, the beer, the brew, yeah. This inaugural Irving Frost 5K is part of an expansion of the Irving Marathon. In order to grow the Irving Marathon to the level that we wanted to grow, we need to bring more people here year-round. So for that, we decided to introduce the Irving Marathon Running Series. Expect more competitive running events like this one throughout the year, along with even more frequent and casual social runs. Those are free and meant to promote the sport and build friendships. You come here, you meet people. When you run, you know, your mind is clear. You feel a little healthier. And race director Lazaro Alvarez also wants to promote his hometown. Our goal is to make Urban the preferred running location for North Texas. And with this development here, it's, it's very good, it's very convenient and it's very scenic. Uh, it's really nice, like I've, I've seen this place like under construction from the highway but never been on this side of the building, but it's, it's pretty nice. Before this event wraps up, it's time for some awards. In the costume contest, not many people are willing to take on Mark Sue. There are a few pets, but in the end... Panda! No, there was no contest. Panda had it, for sure. I have my own goals to make everybody happy. Prizes won and memories made at the first ever Irving Frost 5K. Thank you for being part of the Irving Marathon Running Series. Thomas Gandy for City Source.